The ProSolve recycling system consists of three parts. The ProSolve unit itself, an activated carbon filter with 40 steel recycling certification tags, and an anti-static ground wire. The activated carbon filter threads directly to the opening of the ProSolve unit. It minimizes odor and acts as a secondary flashback arrester during the recycling process. The 40 steel recycling certification tags provided with each filter serve as the filter replacement indicator. When all the tags have been used, the filter must be replaced. The anti-static ground wire adds additional operator safety as required by OSHA. Lightweight and easy to use, the ProSolve unit can be either handheld or bench mounted for operation. Thread the fuel cylinder completely into the bottom opening of the ProSolve unit, allowing the top handle to rise freely. Briefly press the gauge activation button to determine the fuel content of the cylinder. If the gauge registers in the red area, the fuel cylinder should not be emptied with the ProSolve unit now. Remove the cylinder and put it back into service. If the gauge registers in the green area, press the activation button to fully vent the remaining propellant. Press the upper handle to penetrate the nylon sealing sleeve of the propane cylinder. Then lift the upper handle to remove the nylon sleeve and press it again to contact the internal valve stem. Rotate the knob counterclockwise for eight revolutions to remove the valve stem. Finally, remove the propane cylinder from the ProSolve unit. Once removed, turn the cylinder upside down and the valve stem will drop out. Then disengage the nylon sealing sleeve by lifting the upper handle. There's just one more step. Insert the steel recycling certification tag into the fuel cylinder to indicate that the valve system is removed and the cylinder is empty and ready to be recycled. Each recycled cylinder conserves 5,450 BTUs in subsequent steel production.